All right, guys, welcome back to Cowskills. I know I took like a five-day break. That is very poor from me. I have let you guys down and this channel down. I can only apologize. I've come back. I'm feeling comfier than ever, and I'm ready now to react to some good videos. So today on the menu, we've got 10 guys date one Instagram supermodel. Let's watch this and see how we get on. If any guy makes it to the end this time, we're going to give him a grand prize. See, there's going to be two boxes, and they can choose. Box one, it's money. Number two, it's it's an extravagant date. I like this idea. This is a cool idea. I might have to steal this idea off this Donnie and do this on my channel, but we'll see how this one goes first. Extravagant date to the Maldives. That's right. We're what? Gonna... Okay. I thought he was saying like an extravagant date, you know, nice little restaurant or whatever. Yo, you're literally going to go to the Maldives. But here's the catch. If she doesn't actually like him, my oh. suspicions is... Oh, here we go. She's going to choose the money. There's only a hundred bucks in here. So, let's see what happens. Oh snap, it's a finesse. You'd be thinking if there's the Maldives in one, you're thinking at least a couple grand in the other, like minimum. To those of you that don't know, the Maldives, if you want to stay at a really nice hotel, you're looking at like 10 grand minimum. Hi. All I'm right, here see we you. go. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. All right. Yo, she's keeping that eye contact. Like this, Is it? So, yeah, no, That's I'm cute. excited. Tell me a little about yourself. What do you like to do? So what I like to do in my free time, I like to work out a lot. Being healthy is like yeah. really important. Like, you know, there's this is a meme about Instagram models and whether they're just like cardboard. It's like talking to a wall. I look forward to seeing if this girl lives up to the stereotype or not. What do you what do for you? work? Oh, so I do social media management for a couple clients. Cool. What do you do? Okay. I also like to work out. I uh, I try to go every day. I'm not gonna lie, it's a good looking bloke, you know. Like, you trying to take me to the Maldives, boss. No, I'm just I'm just joking. God. Okay, for the first question, ask him when was the first time he got tested. Um, that's cute. Um, so when's the last time he got tested? Wait, what? So there's a girl in the corner controlling what she says. I'm a little bit confused. I thought it was the guy trying to convince the girl. For SEDs. Uh, can't say I ever have. Damn. Actually. Oh, That's no. First of all, you, you got to get tested, but in that case, you've just got to say, yeah, it's because I'm actually still a virgin. Or you drop the, I've never had unprotected sex. How can you not te get tested every, like, what, couple months? Make sure you're safe if you're having sex. So I'm assuming he's having sex. I hope he's having sex. Yeah, she hit me with a curveball, asked me if I ever got tested, and I didn't, but... She's not really my type anyway. Oh my god, no, let's not be salty about it, King. Let's not be salty. Come on. Hi, how are you? Hello, I'm Felix. Felix? Yes, Siri. Felix. Pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you. Instantly off the bat, he's coming across as a beta here. I feel like in something like this, you gotta come in, chest popping out, and they're like, what's up? You see, I would go quite far in this. Well, I work as a videographer and photographer by day. And I oh, he's so nervous. Look at the way he sat. We gotta fix that. Look at her straight on. Homie's just nervous as hell. Mm, are you nervous? A little bit. Why? Cameras are on me. Mm. All the pressure is on. Don't you do this for a living? I film other people, mm -hmm. not myself. Interesting. So you do freelance? Yes, I do. That's cute. Oh my days, yo! This woman is so intense. She never drops eye contact with you. What else do you want to know? Surprise me. Oh my god, he's on the road! Well, I learned five computer programs. How many people have you slept with? Interesting. Quick question. Mm -hmm. How many people have you slept with? Five. Oh, okay. What? He wasn't that confident, and I'm a confident young lady, so you can't match my energy. It's not going to work out, and my muscles can't be bigger than yours. Jesus, that is brutal. I think it was a bit harsh as soon as he said five, just to be like, Dang. but yeah, he, he wasn't very confident, and you can tell she's definitely someone. You got to at least match that level of almost authority, you know? He <laughs> Oh my god, he took one look at his head. She just gonna press the fucking buzzer and walked out. Wait, what? I don't know what to do. You got this. Why are you nervous? Are you sure she likes me? <laughs> no, I know she likes you. This is gonna be tough to watch. Don't go in there. Hi. Hi. How are you? Oh, the little Jorge. voice crack? Jorge? Yes. Call me Georgie. Georgie? Yeah. Like the clown. Uh, like the clown? That kills people. <sighs> Yeah. I love that. I know it's my favorite movie. That's cute. I'm Siri. Siri? Yes. If Siri had a face, I'd put you in it. Appreciate it. Thank you. She's fed up of hearing shit pick up lines. If Siri had a face, I'd put you on it. Like, yeah, that's meh. Nah. I used to be a server and then I um, left my job. Same here. I got fired from Chase two months ago. Oh shit. Damn. Oh no. Quick question. 
Um, if we had a date after this, would you sleep with me right after? No. Why? Am because I not attractive enough? This isn't a normal Thursday. Like, she's trying to set him up. Not a one time thing, but I believe in sleeping on the first date. Sleeping on the first date sounds amazing. Yeah? Yeah. Could you handle it? Absolutely. You sure? At first, I thought she was just being like on job. She knew what she was. I'm just getting like kind of bad vibes from this one. I'm a New Yorker, so that's a thing for me. I'm from Connecticut. Connecticut. Right, George! You made it! I like that. He, he got nervous at first, and I was like, eh, I was actually gonna buzz him. But then he tried again, and like, it made up for it. It was a dope conversation. All right, all right, I rate that. Hello. Oh, the fashion, hey. the fashion, Hi. the fashion you? boss. Good, how old are you? I'm 33. That's cute. Yeah, what about you? I'm 22. 22? Oh, you're cute too. That's <laughs> Oh, no. Bye. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It must have been the fashion. Siri. Me. Nice to meet you. Yo, yo, she's yo, into. How are you? I'm fabulous. How are you? I'm good. Where are you from? I'm from Fort Lauderdale. Fort Lauderdale. Were Where you, you born from? there? No. I mean, yes, I was born in Fort Lauderdale, Holy Cross Hospital. Uh huh. What's your ethnicity? My ethnicity, I'm Dominican. Dope. Both Where are you? sides. No, nah, yeah, full, 100%. Full? Yeah. I'm Puerto Rican, both sides. Oh, that's nice. Mm -hmm. I like Puerto Ricans. Do you? Yeah. Why? Um, because they're beautiful. Mm -hmm. They know how to cook. Mm -hmm. They know how to act. I don't know how to cook. Are you sure? <laughs> How can I make sure you're straight? Like, prove to me, are you straight? Prove to you? Yeah. Prove to me you're straight. Is that not a bit of a weird thing to say to someone? Anyways, let me talk more about myself. I'm I want to talk about myself, though. You sure? Mm -hmm. Okay, go for it. So, I do social media marketing. But wait, you didn't answer the question. Okay. You were looking at my necklace. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. That's how you're straight? Mm -hmm. You like crystals? Mm -hmm. Crystal is like... Wait, did I pass? I liked how he came in. He didn't seem like nervous or shy. The first guy seemed shy. Nate seemed really dope. I didn't like the trench coat. Um, he could have kept it simple. Mm. But other than that, he let me talk about myself and just interrupt him. And I kind of like that because that's what I do. Nice meeting you. I'm Misha. I like your shirt. Thank you. All right, Misha. You're very pretty. Am I? Yeah. I think I'm like more than pretty though. Yeah? Pretties for like babies. Oh my god, why am I just starting to like dislike this girl? Just think there's a line between maybe confident and just arrogance. How That's tall right. are you? Oh no. Would How you tall like are me? You? To... I'm about six. About or about are you? or nah he's five eleven. Anyone that says about six foot, they're five eleven. Tell me that All right. about your height. So I buzzed Mista out because he wasn't sure about his height and height's a big thing for me. Either he, you either know her or you don't. You can't say I'm about six. Either you are yeah, or you're not. You no, he can't control it. But if he was more confident, he could have had a chance. Hi. Hey, how's it going? Siri. DJ. Nice DJ. To you. Is that short for something? Daniel Joseph. Oh, that's so cute. What's Daniel, going on, DJ? I like when you say it. But only in certain <laughs> situations, I guess. Tell me um, about yourself. Um, I'm from Michigan. I moved down here in January. Michigan. I love What's Florida so far. Michigan? Um, Detroit. It's amazing. That's cute. It's pure Michigan, you know, it's got a lot of outdoors. What, what do you do for a living? Oh, I'm from Florida, born and raised. Oh, it's awesome. What kind of porn do you watch? Um, All right, straight to the point. I like the live shit. Alive? I like to be involved. That's cute. Yeah. So like when they tell you to do stuff? Yeah. Ask me what kind of porn I watch. What kind of porn do you watch? Girl on girl. That's awesome. Is that an issue? Do you like, uh, would you ever... Would I? Have a threesome? Yeah. Absolutely. That's awesome. Four some, five some. It's like she's got no emotion, like four some, five some. Like what, you gonna fucking fight about it? I'm not gonna lie, this guy's probably handling it the best out of anyone so far. Um, how big is your thingy compared to this? I wouldn't measure. Like too big? Yeah. I like that. Bye. He was definitely, in my opinion, the best so far. Hello. How are you? Good, how are you? Okay. Oh, this guy I'm came Brian. through with the jacket. I can tell he loves a bit of golf on the weekend, no doubt in my mind. You ask the questions, I ask the questions. Surprise me. Um, are you from South Florida? I am. Uh, what part? Fort Lauderdale. That's nice. How, how long have you? you been down here? Born and raised. Oh, you never left. Nope, I never. Oh, I went to Orlando a couple years for school. And then Do you I believe in monogamy? That's it. Like, and then say, because I have a best friend and we always like to try the same guy. That's awesome. Do you, do you believe in monogamy? I don't know uh, what that means. It's when you have what? sex with one person for the rest of your life. Oh, I've heard of that. My parents have spoke about mm -hmm. it. It's like old school way. I mean, I'm down to mingle. That was the most uncomfortable thing I've heard in a long time. He's like, <laughs> I like to mingle. I'm back. Uh, How you doing? 
Fabulous. She defo likes this Donny. I could tell from the moment this guy worked in on round one, this was the guy that she definitely appreciated. I'm gonna keep this short, sweet, and simple. Mm. I wanna take you on a date. That's cute. Where do you wanna go? I wanna go to Swan, Miami. That's fine. We can go there, but under one condition. Mm -hmm. okay. I drive. Even better. That's fine. What kind of car you drive? A red Mercedes Benz. That's true, I'll be honest. I have a question for you. Yes. So, um, I've heard in the past you have issues with threesomes. Is that gonna be a problem? Not this time. Are you sure? I'm positive. Okay. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. What's your name again? Nate. What's my Full name? name? Nathan J. Tolentino. Remember that. That's your What's last name. name? Sienna. Oh, all right. He's way better this time because he's not as nervous. Sienna. Sienna. Mhm. Mm yeah. I won. That was my piece. Come on. That was perfect meeting. Anyways, <laughs> so we're actually going on this date. Real question. This is exactly how you are in real life. What the hell is that? Oh. All right. So he's the only contestant that made it this far. Yes. Okay. And because you two made it, I promised you a reward. Okay. Right. There's a weird like feeling of it being a little set up. I don't know why. But... Catch is that you guys get to choose which one you pick, right? <laughs> so in box number one, I put money, which you will have to split. Okay. In box number two, luxurious date that I'm gonna pay for all of it. But you guys have to choose. I feel like the girl on the right would just choose the money and the geezer on the left would probably go for the date. That Hold sounds on. so, I like experiences. I have enough money on my own. I don't. <laughs> I love the honesty from this guy. You know what? Fuck it. Number two. I'll take number two. Number two. Damn. Can I just say that I am? I'm so scared right now. You're freaking me out. Oh, I just, God. Like, I am impressed. I bet. I proved myself wrong. Sorry, I'm going to curse my camera. Open, open up. Open up number two. This is I'm crazy. So scared. I hope this is legit. Because if this is legit, it's sick. <laughs> open it up. Rats are cute. Do you like dogs? I love dogs. All right, make sure. I'm so nervous right you, now. You love doggy style? Anyways, what's that paper? What the fuck is this? Where are we going? Bahamas? You're fucking joking. Let me see this no. shit. You're lying. Nah, no, that's cat. No, he's lying. Say so you swear to God. I am impressed. $100. Oh, that's nothing. Yo, you were mean. Like, that was a lot. <laughs> that yeah. was a lot. But I'm impressed that my man Nate made it this far. Like, what did he do right? He was confident. I like that. That was it. So if anyone knows if they actually went on the holiday or not, please let me know, guys. I'm a little skeptical. I feel like they probably didn't go. But if they did, awesome. I, I, want, I want like an update video, you know? That's what I'm after.